Genealogy researchers often deal with the problem of finding an old town that has long since disappeared from the map. Or perhaps you know of a location that is not now in the same county that it was 100 or even 200 years ago. AnyMap has solutions to these problems. AnyMap is a program which shows maps for each of the 50 states with all the county boundary changes that have taken place since the first settlements. You can quickly display the map for any given year. Or a run mode will allow you to view all changes in sequence. What you're seeing now is a sped up view of the run mode. A narrative of significant changes is located in the box on the lower left. Within AnyMap, SiteFinder is a database containing more than 1 million listings for cities, towns, and many other places of historical interest in the U.S., giving the state and county where they are located, plus the GPS coordinates. Let's add a marker to our map now. To begin, I'm going to open a map by selecting File, and then Open, and selecting Illinois. Next, I will choose Options and Site Find. Since I have a place in mind, I'm going to search by name. I type in Chatham, Illinois, and you'll notice I could have gotten more specific by entering county information as well. Double-clicking my selection will allow me to add this location to my pluck list. Once the item is on the pluck list, I can go to Options and Plot to add the location to the map. As you can see, I can select maps by clicking Next, as you see me doing in this video, and by selecting the specific year I would like to view. Perhaps I'm searching for where an ancestor who lived in Chatham was buried. I can plot cemetery information in a similar way. To do this, click Options, Site Find, and then Search and By Location. I'm going to select all cemeteries and churches within a five mile radius. Any of the results could be added to the pluck list and plotted on the map. To plot multiple locations on the map, perform the same action as we did before. Click Options, then Site Find, and search how you wish. I am searching by name and adding Litchfield to my map. I'd now like to know just how far apart these two locations are, and I can easily find this by clicking Options and Measure Mode, and then clicking my marker, followed by a right click. You'll notice a red circle appear around your marker when you've done it correctly. As you can see, Chatham and Litchfield are separated by 34 miles. If you'd like to save your map, you'll want to export it out of the program by clicking File and then Export. As you can see, the file has been exported into a BMP file. I can now use this in another program or email it to a relative. We so hope you enjoy using Animap for your research. Please let us know how you plan to use it. Stop in and see us today.